almost five years since the tragic loss of his daughter and another chapter in that story yet to unfold. But Anthony Cruz finding solace in the recording studio. The Halfway Tree singer's latest track, a cover of an R&B mega hit. Anthony Cruz making hit during the pandemic. Albums for King Jammies, Tad's International, including a tribute to Daddy Roy, in addition to a covers compilation. And in times like these, good to have a back catalogue to cushion the effects of COVID. No man, no man, no bring gun, come a dance. No gonna dance. Them boy in our class, them black the road, halfway tree, mama, um, turn it up. Um, place to blood with Bojo. Uh, I cut dub plate almost every day. I have my own studio at my house. And when you have a good catalog of music, you can't let the hunger. Because, I mean, South System, you have DJs right across the world like doing dub plates. I think I'm, I'm one of the singers where I do dub plate almost every day. Turn it up now, let them hear it in the streets. The Over your career, what was the best move you ever made? Um, one of the best moves I've ever made was to um, send me a come Jamaica, come meet Bobby Digital, Jan Jan, King Jammies, Mixing Finger. I was a young youth singing big people music. You got it bad when you're out with someone and you keep on thinking about somebody else. You did a lot of covers. Yeah, because they work. I mean, Jamaican like good covers. When we met just a boss and I come out, they had me had uh, as this ladies man. You know, um, I used to do all the fets and stuff like that. So um, now that my image and my whole have grown into, you know, this Rastafarian, um, I mean, that's typical. You know, when we got people love me the same way, you know, them rocks, but when the next song I come, you know, everybody, Halfway Tree, you know, Halfway Tree is one of the biggest songs produced by Big A from Iron Fen. People always have that one song, like oh yeah, Bob Marley, One Love, them have a song with them identifying. Right a burger king or down a taste Those lovey-dovey songs and you know that kind of vibe doesn't really seem to be what people are focused on right now. I'm on the same around the place, but it's just your fans like you and I move with you. I mean, Marcel Griffith still have our fans, I still have my fans, which is Spice still have fans. So sometimes it's just what you understand now, the media kind of highlight more. You understand or what saying? young people are into. Uh, yeah, but it's not all about young people. It's about who the world. Right now, most of the young people are, are listening to needs straighten up. You know, the whole of gun lyrics and the whole of things we are going on because you always have to look to people who are older for guidance, no matter how smart you think you are. You understand? Just for example, I see you um, interview with a younger um, DJ the other day. Um, he said, you know, a couple of uh, things where, but at the same time, you need some guidance, you know, because you leave there, sir, and you're still going back and you're going to do a gun show. No. With all this violence going on, you want to do positive music, you know, and look to positive entertainers for positive collaboration. All and soul. Originals still in the mix and making covers. Um, I'm a person like this. I love the voice. I like to, I like to create. My, my next thing is, what's the next song I'm going to create? He pays tribute to a roll call of Jamaican greats. Garnet Till, Dennis Brown, uh, Freddie McGregor, Delroy Wilson. Um, them man, they set it. And right now, if you turn on your radio, you're going to hear one of them man they play right now. So the music there has no limit. And you have to do music where it can carry you through good and bad times, live on forever. You're going to hear a gunman shift to do. <laughs> Well, we were, we would have liked to do is, you know, for them youth that we do them song there, we know, say, um, they are, just look at, this, look at the entertainers who sing positive music and look where they are, and look at the entertainers who embrace the gun and the badness with them there. That's all I have to say. <laughs> you have no regrets about that move, that, that the, a direction, that a sort of spiritual change of focus oh, that, that is, you made. Why you gave me goosebump a while ago? Let me tell you something. That is one of the best moves I've ever made. Because I can tell you this, it's my cousin over there, Phil. I'm a person who loves the river. And you know, Garnet Silk is my uncle, and I got that concept of who will go into the river and pray. And everything, everything that I go to the river and ask for, I get it. 
everything. Cruz's identification with Rasta and changing his priorities put to the test with the 2017 shooting murder of his teenage daughter and her mother in Florida. The accused killer still awaiting his day in court. Yeah, it's been a long time. Um, I, I know that he's been charged and stuff, and you know, before the, everything, we can't really say too much, but he's been charged and he's been there for a while, um, behind bars and all of that. And um, as I say, each time, I just have to just relive it each time, you know? The, the whole, the whole, when you do an interview, people ask you the question about it, when you go on the street, people assure them, can't do it. it never stop. But I'm just glad that I have the strength of the Almighty that bring me through, but can keep me focused, you know? Is there a trial date? I think it's March. I, I don't know the date exactly, but I know it starts in March. This and 22. you're going to be there? Well, to be honest with you, I mean, I'm in a decision there yet, you know, because um, I can't even answer that yet. Can't answer that yet, because me not really think I can really stand up on the same ground with a man where um, take my daughter away from me. I don't think I can really do that. I just picture her in Florida. The last time, you know, um, I saw her, I just picture her like that all the time. I had to have two kids, Jamari, my son, and Shanice, my daughter, and, two, and she, that girl is one of the brightest girls in our school. You know, so, very tough, very tough. But I'm just glad me have a strength can hold up, you know? Are you any clearer why it happened? No, you know, I, I, no, no, not at all, not at all. I mean, to tell you the truth, the, it, it was a whole, it's like, you know, when you have a couple where just have a, what are the word name now? Um, you just can't get along, but at the same time, you try to get along, you know? And um, a they, they were always fighting, things always happen, you know? Um, when you see relationship like those, you have a walkway, you know? You know, you have to walk His 13-year-old son knew music, a secure future. Anthony Cruz has narrowed down what really matters. Just basically just get my life on a level where I can look back and say, you know, I've done some good work and, and you know, set yourself. That, that, that means when you, when you reach an older age, you can have some money for go to the doctor and <laughs> and all of them things, and you know, make some uh, mistake where you know a lot of people might make some bad choices and bad mistakes, some into stuff like that, maybe farming, um, some car mart. Well, we want to have everything right now with money, you know? <laughs> everything that's legal. <laughs>